Hey guys, Crypto June here with another video. In today's video, I want to talk about Alep Zero, and I talked about Alep Zero multiple times because I love the project. I see the potential of the project and I also see the chances of the project because I personally think it has a lot of more room for growth. It is currently sitting at a market cap of 350 million. Even if we compare the fully diluted market cap of Alep Zero to the one of Avalanche during the 2021 bull run, we can see that Avalanche had a 25 or 30 billion market cap and Alep Zero is currently sitting at a market cap of 350 million. And so if we do a quick math, we can do a quick math. Let's do it. And let's calculate the market cap, not 30 billion because it is possible, but let's be honest. Let's try 50 or 20 billion. So let's do 20 billion because I saw several projects, layer ones especially, in 2021 reaching 20 billion market cap. So we do 20 billion divided by 350 million, and that gives us a 57x. So 57x, guys. So that is the reason I'm so believing in Alpha Zero. There is room for growth. The market cap is not that high and that they also keep on building. The first thing I want to show to you is Common. And Common is a decentralized exchange. It is not live yet on Alep Zero. So there is not a DEX on Alep Zero yet, but it will come very soon. They announced in Q1 2024, we can expect Common. And also Liminal. Liminal is a zero knowledge privacy framework, which is also launching in the coming months. And beside that, they are also announcing a bridge. And most is a bridge that can bring from Ethereum to Alep Zero. And you know what I mean, right? If there funds on Ethereum comes to the Alep Zero chain together with decentralized exchange more projects will start building on Alep Zero because there will be more funds available and also tradable on the chain and guys another thing that I want to show to you about Alep Zero before that let's get back to the channel of Crypto June because we are past the 2000 subscribers we started only seven months ago we posted 175 videos and yeah I'm so grateful thank you everyone who's watching my videos and I will appreciate a like and subscribe so if you're not like and subscribe yet hit the like and subscribe button and let's move back to Alep Zero because another one we are pleased to announce a partnership with Alep Zero with the digital euro association so this is bullish guys it's official this digital euro association partners with Alep Zero foundation and now another project a very big project is partnered up with Deutsche Telekom Telekom MMS and guys Fetch AI is not a small project. It's listed on Coinbase and many other exchanges. So for Alep Zero, partnering up with them is not like a small milestone. No, it's a big one. And they keep on building it. And I'm in Alep Zero since the pre-sale, like in 2022. And I'm still holding. I never sold any token and I bought myself more tokens. We have a very nice bag of Alep Zero. And yeah, I'm such a strong believer in this project. And feel free to check the project out. I made another video about Alep Zero on my channel with a complete overview of what they are doing and what they are building. But in this video, I want to keep it more like what is going on with Alep Zero and what can we expect in the short and mid term. Let's go to the chart because, guys, Alep Zero chart looks beautiful. We saw that it first pumped to $1.90. And also, we saw, it was during the Bitcoin pump in the beginning of this year. And after that, we saw it going back to 70 cents. I was aping as a mad ape into this token. I accumulated a lot of tokens. And I'm thankful to everyone who sold his Alep Zero at the bottom. But we saw that Alep Zero was trying to get back to the previous all-time high of $1.90. I am not talking about this one because it was in the beginning and there were way less tokens available. But $1.90, we couldn't break it but it's now on its way to the next resistance it's sitting at $1.45 and if we break this we can see a quick pump to $1.90 that's what I'm thinking but let's see how it goes but if we break that 
and we get back to this level we will see the price going way higher there is no limit at that after that so what i expect is we go into this one we have a small correction to here we break it and again we're going back and then we're going back to 90 and then let's see how it goes because after 1 dollar 90 i am super bullish and i'm still bullish because alum zero keeps on delivering and the exchange is not even live yet the bridge is not even live yet and they have projects in the pipeline that want to build on alum zero so i am super bullish i hope you too and if you're still here like subscribe and i see you in the next video bye bye